Hello, welcome back to a new video of Lauren Hardy memorabilia and Charlie Chaplin collectibles. In this video I have a collection of more paper items, uh, original stacks, photos and a few more autographs I have that are in my collection. But starting off with the first item which is a really um, interesting one which is a envelope. Um, unfortunately it doesn't have the original photograph with it, it's just the envelope. So I'm guessing this would have um, held the original uh, portrait shot of Law and Hardy with their original autographs. And uh, this has been addressed to a Mr. and Mrs. C.V. Burton in Cheshire. So this is a, a, a Law and Hardy feature productions, 511 Pacific Mutual Building, Los Angeles, 14 California photograph return after 10 days. So this is uh, Manchester 31st of July 1947. So it's a really nice large envelope uh, that would have held Lauren Hardy's original portrait shot with possibly their autographs and uh, I just love the, the cartoon original characters there of Lauren Hardy. So it's a really nice item to have but it's really well worn and um, got a few stains and marks on it but that adds to its authenticity and uh, gives it all the uh, the character of what it is today so that's the first item and then the second one if you remember in the last video I spoke about the Abbott Costello trade cards that I have as I have a few items on Abbott Costello not uh, to the capacity as Lauren Hardy but um, the uh, Abbott Costello trade cards and they have uh, this special card which is like a, a talking card, which is like a special, like sort of limited edition card, and uh, it's, uh, it actually does speak. If I press the button, you can hear Lou's voice. He says, "Hey, Abbott." So it's a really nice addition to have, uh, part of the trade cards, and uh, this is still sealed. So this is brand new from 1996. So that's a nice. Uh, addition to have to the card collection and then just moving on to some of the autographs the first one I've got is of Iris Adrian which is of the second autograph that, um, of this actress here Iris Adrian so this is the second autograph of hers that I have and uh, I think that she signed that to Louise happy to know you Iris Adrian so it's a really nice example there of her signature and of course she played Alice in our relations 1936 and then the next one I have is of Jack Barty which is a really nice original postcard size like real photograph of an earlier shot of Jack Barty with his signature there so that's a really nice early example of Jack Barty and uh, he played Jitters in Oliver the Eighth, uh, 1934. And then the next one, which is uh, a really interesting one, this is uh, original photo of Will Stanton. Really nice old uh, photo, and he is full. Um, I don't think it's actually full signature, but he's put a good, uh, good length note on that. You can just about see it. It's in black fountain pen. If I can just, if I can just about read it. He's got to my. <coughs> I think he's put there to my dear old folk, Alf and Ben. Weird fondest love. Good, uh, God bless you all. You always lovingly will. And I'm not sure what he's put underneath there, but that is the eleventh of the first. 1916 so this is a really early photo of this uh, American actor so um, what is the connection so he was in a lot of the earlier Lauren Hardy films so he was in Love and Hisses, Sugar Daddies, uh, Sadist Beware, Do Detectives Think That All 1927 and then he was in Pardon Us 1931 and he was also in Any Old Port 19. 31 where he played the drunk at the, at the ringside where he's uh, putting on a bet when uh, Stan is uh, boxing in the ring so um, 
where he's obviously he looks out there so this is obviously an earlier shot of him so this is a really nice uh, collector collector's rare rare sign piece uh, that's also another co-star connected to Lion Hardy and then on from that you have the Stax photos so um, I have showed some uh, original Bud Stacks photos in the past with Lauren Hardy's image and also some of the co-stars and normally all the Stacks photos on the back they're all signed uh, and uh, or, or stamped on the back and uh, with dates on them so there's all um, typed uh, paper on the back with the description of what's on the f uh, photograph and um, oh. So I've got the cat in here with me, so I'm just making sure she doesn't tread on anything. So um, stay there. Right. So Bud Stacks Graves. So he was born 1885, died 1972. So he was 86. Uh, so he was the stills photographer at the Harrow Studios, uh, taking many photos of Lauren Hardy and our gang and all the other stars and uh, crew at the Harrow Studios. So um, I will do my best to. Um, get all the names right on all these stacks photos. None of them are of Laurel and Hardy. Uh, they're all the co-stars and uh, all people that work with them or connected to them. So um, you've got starting off with this one which is of uh, Thelma Todd which we, which we all know she died tragically young. Um, so again at the back there you've got a photo by Stax stamped out on the back of that, so it's a really, really lovely photograph there of Thelma Todd. Uh, next one, you've got Charlie Chase. It's a lovely uh, shot there of uh, Charlie Chase. Um, it's also been signed on the band. For a minute, you kind of get excited, think, oh, that's his signature, but uh, that's not his signature, it's obviously just put his name on the back to, to say who it is. Uh, the next one, if I can get this right, this is Nina Cortero, uh, which is this lady. And as far as I know, she was in uh, The Devil's Brother, 1933. Um, or far the other lady, the other name for the film. But there's information on the back that's all been uh, typed on the back with a piece of paper that's stuck to it. So this has got February 20th, 1934 in the back of that. So some of them are dated, which is also really, really nice. Uh, this one is Rosina Lawrence. Again, you've got her name on the back of that one. I'm going to go through them reasonably quick because there's about 30 of them here. Um, and I will put them on my page as well, so you can see them in more detail. Uh, this one, again, is um, Rosina Lawrence. And uh, that's a really nice shot there of oh, Rosina. And also Rosina Lawrence again there. Really, really fancy outfits and uh, uh, stage or um, film costumes that they have on. Really, really uh, nice to see that in these sort of like screen test shots. Uh, that one there is of uh, Felix Knight. That's uh, from um, Babes in Toyland, March of the Wooden Soldiers. And this one here is Florence Roberts, again Babes in Toyland, and again here with uh, with Barnaby, it's played by Henry Brandon. Really nice shot that one there, and a really nice shot there, Florence Roberts again, portrait shot. So these are all original. These are all original. Um, stacks photos they're all stamped on the back all of them so it makes them all the rare all, all the more interesting so this one here is Patsy Kelly 
uh, it's co-starred with Tom and Todd and Hal Roach MGM Comedies. Get a really nice shot there. This one is interesting. I, I was a bit confused at first, but this one is actually Paulette Goddard. And I have looked her up, and uh, apparently she was in a very small scene in Lauren Hardy's 1929 birthmarks as a passenger. Uh, but we know that also she went on to work in uh, modern times and a great dictator with Charlie Chaplin and then also married him for a short time. But uh, she obviously worked at the Howard Studios as well in her earlier career. Uh, next one is the famous Billy Gilbert. Lovely shot there. Billy Gilbert. And again, this one here of Billy Gilbert. And the actor with him there is that's Billy Bletcher. For a minute I thought that was uh looked a bit like James Finnison, but it obviously isn't. Uh, Billy Gilbert again, obviously in the character of Taxi Driver. Really beautiful portrait shots. This is a really nice one of Charlie Chase, really love that one. If you get uh, original autograph uh, of Charlie Chase, you definitely put that one with it, with the original Stax photo. And then again here another one of Billy Gilbert. And then the next one here is of Sharon Lynn. Sharon Lynn that was in uh, Wild West. This one I got a bit confused with at first, so I had to sort of try and look it up. But the little girl is Dorothy de Borba, if I could pronounce that right, but she's a child actress of our gang, and she was also in The Stolen Jewels, which is uh, a small part that Lauren Hardy had in the short comedy. Uh, this chap here, I'm not too sure who he is, but as far as we know, he was a Hal Roach um, a Studios director. Um, so that's all I know at the moment, unless anyone out there knows who this chap is. But uh, this little girl, that's Dorothy from our gang. Uh, this one here is Mary Wilson. She played Contrary Mary in Beijing Toyland. So that's a really nice photo there. Uh, this one, Sharon Lynn again. Fancy, fancy costume, costume gear. And also, Sharon Lynn again. This is a really nice shot of uh, June Lang in her costume. This is actually in her costume for. Um, uh, Bonnie Scotland, which gives you all the details on the back of that, which is really, really interesting. And Sharon Lynn again. And also another one of Sharon Lynn, obviously different costume changes, different shots. And again, she was way out west. And we have, as I showed earlier, Jack Barty's original autograph. Really nice portrait shot of him there. Uh, and also, again, there in character. And then the next one I have is of Jean Darling. Of our gang and also she was in Babes in Toyland. have Charlotte, Charlotte or Charlotte, Charlotte Henry, names in Toyland, Bo Peep, lovely photo there and then the last one I have of Zazu Pitts with Thelma Todd, they obviously team together in a lot of short comedies and uh, almost like a female version of Lauren Hardy but they team together in shorts and also I think some feature films as well together but there you go, a really nice shot there both actresses there. All right, that's it, that's all 30. So what I will do, I will put them on my page more so you can see them in more detail and I'll take pictures on the other side so you could read the descriptions as well. And um, I hope you enjoyed this video. 
and uh, I'll just show this again, absolutely love that, that's just brilliant. Even that would look great framed, I just love the blue around the edge as well on that, it just makes it what it is, really really great. So thanks for watching this video and um, hope you find it interesting and uh, look out for the next one soon, there will be the next one will be more signed items and more sort of paper items as well. So um, happy collecting everyone, bye.